Our skier safety is our priority because the next word after safety is fun. And you can't have fun if you're doing it unsafe. Since COVID-19 kept many people cooped up in their homes, Wincom says many people have been coming to have some outdoor winter fun. But this can create confusion on the slopes. So on the mountain there are certain areas where, oh, say trails come together. So you'll have more people in that spot. Well, you have to be paying attention. These outdoor winter activities can be fun, but also can get out of hand at times. Wickham says it's crucial to follow the skiing responsibility code like this one right here. The number one rule says to always stay in control and be able to stop and avoid any other people or objects. Your skier and snowboard responsibility is a common sense of courtesy. And when I say that, so when you're coming downhill, if you're gonna overtake somebody, you let them know you're coming. Um, you don't cut people off. Wickham says one of Herman Mountain snowboarding instructors was injured recently by colliding into another skier. According to Northern Lights Sports Program Manager, it's important to wear safety equipment before hitting the slopes. For snowboarding, you're gonna see a lot more wrists, hand, elbow, shoulder injuries, um, concussions, head injuries are right up there. Um, because in a snowboard, your, your feet are actually fairly um, solid in a snowboard. Wickham says following these safety tips can save you a trip to the emergency room. In Herman, I'm Sierra Jordan reporting for ABC7 and Fox 22.